Washing your hands with soap is better, but if you have no soap and water, hand sanitizer is the second best thing. Commercial hand sanitizer can get expensive, and with the shortage of hand sanitizer due to COVID-19, you may have to resort to making your own. Making your own hand sanitizer is a simple process that results in a formula you can customize to suit your personal tastes. Choose either alcohol or witch hazel and tea tree oil sanitizer. 1. Alcohol-based hand sanitizer. Gather your ingredients. This sanitizer closely emulates the commercial kind, without all the chemicals and without the bad smell. Hand sanitizer should not replace hand washing, just use it when you really need it. Here's what you'll need. 2 thirds cup 99% rubbing alcohol isopropyl alcohol or 190 proof grain alcohol. 1 third cup pure aloe vera gel, preferably without additives. 8 to 10 drops essential oil, such as lavender, clove, cinnamon, or peppermint. Mixing bowl. Spoon. Funnel. Plastic container. Note, before you make a hand sanitizer, clean your work surface thoroughly, and make sure your hands and tools are clean as well. 2. Mix the alcohol and aloe vera gel in the bowl. Pour the ingredients into the bowl and use the spoon to mix them together well. The mixture should be completely smooth. If you want the solution to be thicker, add another spoonful of aloe vera. Or thin it out by adding another spoonful of alcohol. Always use a 2 to 1 proportion of alcohol to aloe vera. Alcohol can damage your skin, and the aloe vera will protect it by providing moisture. 3. Add the essential oil. Add it one drop at a time, stirring as you go. After about 8 drops, smell the mixture to see whether you like the scent. If it seems strong enough, stop there. If you like a stronger scent, add a few more drops lavender, clove, cinnamon and peppermint essential oils have the added benefit of providing additional antiseptic properties to the mixture. If you don't like these scents, it's fine to use whatever scent you enjoy. Lemon, grapefruit and passion fruit all work well. 4. Funnel the mixture into the container. Place the funnel over the mouth of the container and pour the hand sanitizer in. Fill it up, then screw on the lid until you're ready to use it. A small squirt bottle works well if you want to carry the sanitizer with you throughout the day. If you make too much for the bottle, save the leftover sanitizer in a jar with a tightly fitted lid. Please subscribe to our channel and also share it with your friends. Do not forget to check out more videos, which will appear shortly.